Alright, so um, I'm watching this boring race right now. I will be doing an Xfinity Series race reaction when I can, but um, 18 laps to go. Um, went to commercial break. Let's see what happens. Corey Heim getting out of line. All the cars are bouncing a little bit, but it continues to bounce when they get back to the smoother part of the racetrack. I think he's having some sort of an issue, and I know we reported that Drew Dollar was... So if you, if you see why my setup looks weird, it's because I'm not at my house. I'm currently out of friends for the weekend. driving well enough to stay up front right now. That's a good point. You know, I, uh, that, that, that crossover tunnel gate, whatever you want to call it, it's rough. It's, it's not that rough. It shouldn't be that rough, and you, you can even tell from the cars around him. Oh, it's not single file anymore, which is interesting. There comes Brett Holmes on the high side. Battle with Ty Gibbs. He clears Ty right there. 17 to go. Ooh. Ooh, that's a bad spot. Ooh, that's a bad spot. Wow. That surprised me. Barely any room on the racetrack, dude. That was crazy. Barely any room, dude. I don't know how. I thought Lancaster was a lap car for a second. Then I look at the board. Who knows? It might get interesting in these upcoming last 15 laps, so... We'll see what happens. Oh, Ty Gibbs! I told y'all, it was going to get interesting. Dang, that sucks for Ty, though. Oh, yep, he ain't going to go much farther. Oh. As soon as I said I was going to get interested in the last 15 laps, right there, that happens. That kind of sucks because I like Ty Gibbs and I wanted him to win, but Greg Van Alst involved. Let's see what happened right here. Yep, I thought this was going to, I thought they were going to wreck right here, but, wow. Sanchez just turned him. We didn't turn him on purpose, but he got into him and also took a hit right there. I swear, Arca has the weirdest camera views. He's gonna get hit again right here. It's crazy. 
to the tribal there as well. Maybe even more final just to That's just insane, dude. Like I believe I was foreshadowing there, but you know <laughs> what do I know? I don't think you can really put a blame on anybody for that one. Just just keep trying hard to get as much momentum as you can. You hate that for the thirty five car because he was running so good all day and, and up towards the front we just talked about, you know, his That's frustrating for Ty. He come out here on the weekends and uh but the good thing everyone's uh everyone's safe. Yep. Let's listen to Nick Sanchez's radio here. Oh. Wow. That is Tyler Green, his spotter. Tyler usually spotting for Kerbush, so he knows that they do not get around this place. Your own spotter calling you out like that. You must know something's wrong if you're. Well, your spar was gonna call you out regardless, but you know, you got you guys get it. While we're rating, this dog just likes to follow me. It's my friend's dog. Yeah. So things are going. I swear, the amount of Menards commercials. How many are there going to be? I'm just giving you guys some good, hilarious commentary while we wait. Ooh. Well, I'm back. After that hilarious commentary, they're just showing the replay right now. And people are asking the same question, and... I'm going to ask it too. Why is Ty Gibbs sponsorless for this weekend? Doggo. But you've done an awesome job here. Just 11 laps to go, but you lost your drafting partner, Ty Gibbs. Uh, you got anybody else lined up to help you? Yeah, I hate to see that, but uh, man, we're going to use anybody. You know, whoever is uh, whoever's willing to get to the front wants to be aggressive, but that's going to be our partner. So anybody, uh, we've had a, a lot of chances to get the red today, but we've been real aggressive, and it, it got us to this point. So uh, just, just very thankful for uh, for Golden Eagle. And, Brett Holmes a good contender right now. Ten to go, presented by Reese's. And that's his crew chief this year. He said they have a great relationship, and he feels like he really is a different driver than he was at this race a year ago. And you could see that, just how aggressive but smart today. Here's that save they were talking about. The save once again. And of course, the smallest incident of the day gets red flagged. Nice. R.I.P. Charlie Glotzbag. Oh, it's Tony. Ty Gibbs.
Yes, sir, Ty. Okay, let's try this again. Seven laps to go. What a restart by Brett Holmes. You don't go too far out for longs. That's the problem with them. That's the problem. Oh. Sanchez right there in second. Six to go. Is it just me, or does Arca have the weirdest onboard camera? Like, I don't know if that's just me, but, you know, that's... That's how I look at it. Oh, someone slid down the track right there. They didn't get it though, but you know. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, no. Oh, that's bad. Oh no. He needs to get out of that thing immediately. He needs to get out like immediately. Oh my god. Wow, dude, that was scary. Yeah, it looks like he got out, but he's on the ground right now. Wow, that's scary, dude. Holy crap. I hope he's all right, man. That is just a scary thing to see. I want to know what to do in that situation, dude. That is just terrifying. Oh, that's a good sign. That's, that's a good sign. He, he climbed out. Yeah, I saw some drivers make contact down the apron like that car right there. Oh, I'm kind of zoomed in a little bit. Sorry about that. Are they actually going to show the hit or are they just going to show what led up to it? Jesus, Fox. I, this is why I can't stand Fox sometimes. They do this all the time. All right, this is what happened right here, and just, oh, wow, and that just ignited, that was such a hard hit, oh, damn, they got, uh, they got him on, like, a stretcher and everything, oh, there he is. That's a great sign. This, that's a great thing to see right there. I think we really underestimate how, you know, safety has come a long way in the sport and just, you know, just, wow. I didn't expect that to happen. That was just crazy.
That car right there is just total, dude. Like, I hope Lancaster's okay. That was just scary. All right, come to the restart here. Will it be the last time, though? Is a good question. Calm before the storm. All right, here we go. Working right here. Nick Sanchez done a nice job. Couple of huge saves today. The big thing is the initial jump. You know, Holmes is controlling the restart. So if the it's just going to be third and fourth, we can stay on that. This decides it all right here. Green and white flag in the air. That means one lap to go. One lap to go. It's the only lap that counts. Yep, they're gonna Venturini Motorsports gonna have their teammates right there with them. Oh, oh, Brett Holmes, he's in the sucker hole. Yep, sucker hole. Oh, Nick Sanchez. Oh, he wanted the block. It's not gonna work. Here comes Corey Heim. Drew Dollar's gonna go with his teammate. Does Corey Heim have it? Oh, oh! Car spinning. We stay green. We stay green. Oh, oh! And Corey Heim has it. Wow. Corey Heim gets it done. Man, Corey Heim is legit on super speedways, man. Respect his name. <laughs> wow. That's awesome. Congrats to him.